Alright guys, welcome back to where we left off with some Dying Light 2. Oh shit, I didn't think this thing <laughs> Oh. Welcome back though. We're um I mean we're almost at the city center, it's right there. Um Yeah, we're at this like uh what is it? It's a car a car factory. So we're chasing Waltz right now. Uh, in the last episode, we kind of, like, got infected and stuff. And... Yeah, we just became, like, overpowered. We, like, actually turned into a zombie for a second. <laughs> Dude, I was looking back today at some of the older um, gameplay footage, you know, of like when they actually showed off the game. And dude, the game like looks so different than it did in every single one of like the gameplays we got shown. Like it's crazy. Like the city is completely different than what the original gameplays actually showcased. Kind of just, it's kind of just mind blowing to be honest. What the fuck? Wait, what? Why? I have to, why do I have to climb across? That's at a decline, I should just fucking slide, but whatever. I had to fucking jump because I was scared I was gonna just die. Why don't people live up here? Like, I, I feel like it's so safe right here because you have to parkour your way up. You know? Put up some UVs. Dude, it's like right here somewhere. There we go. Nice, got some MRE rations. Not too bad. Can I just slide down now? No. Huh. Oh, yeah, I can. I need to go over there. Okay, I can just go down. I'm kind of scared for what's going to be in here because Waltz is kind of just creepy, you know? He's just a weird person. He's, he's just... He's just creepy as fuck. Down long enough. Loot all of them. Who the fuck is seeing me?
think that's good enough. I don't know where any of the other bodies are. Um. Oh. <laughs> Just heal up again real quick. Alright, so I think from the looks of it we gotta parkour up here. Fuck. Give me a second. I am struggling here. There we go. And then I eat this. Nope, definitely can't eat that far. Um. Um. Do I need to go up there? Or is there like loot? I don't know if I actually. Oh, I gotta get over there. So, can I actually like jump to these? Oh, I can. And then to this? There we go. Okay. That makes more sense. And then I'm gonna have to eat to that and eat to that. There we go. There we go. That wasn't too bad. Can I just jump straight up? Yeah. Good night, sir. You call that fighting? Bunch of bitches. I'll do it right. You're one of my curious. Good. Before I kill you, you'll get a chance to witness something spectacular. Everything comes full circle. We return to the beginning. And now, you will witness history in the making. A history? Five years old! You taught your kids! We were kids! You were part of something greater. You owe it to me that you are still alive. That you are stronger than others, special. That you are stronger than I could have imagined. Yet not as strong as me. Any last words? What have you done to my sister? Sister. What have you done to me? Aiden, you're alive. <laughs> Why did he lie? Run. Why did he show compassion? You know what I mean though? Like why did he He showed like he was once he found out that it was we were Aiden he 
seemed almost caring. Like why? Get the fuck out of there! Why does he seem caring? Um. Uh oh, I didn't see that this one was open. Come on, go! So is he not? Uh, is he a bad guy entirely now? Dude, I can't. Like, is he completely a bad guy? Like, is he gonna stay a zombie is what I'm trying to say. Or is he gonna... Is this just because he was injured, so now he... He's gonna be a zombie until he heals up again? That's what I'm just... Uh, that's what I'm curious about, is all. But I mean, I'm I'm, I'm curious on why he showed a form of compassion. See, he told us to run, but then like the zombie part of him said he was gonna kill us, you know. But he himself said, "Run, kid," you know, like. He cares for us. <laughs> Bruh, did you see that? Did you see how stupid that was? I fucking barely hit the the gr uh, the ground right here, and it just fucking no, hurt me. Bitch just closed the door on me. He's, he's like right behind me, dude. I don't want to ruin it, ruin it for myself by just googling it. I'm gonna try to just play through the story, but like I'm genuinely curious now. I hate that she just fucking closes the door on us. I don't know where to go! Maiden, and you? Why are you helping me? Show me your arm. Come on. I won't bite. Well, not hard. We have something in common. I was one of that crazy fucker's subjects, too. Mia, did you know a girl named Mia? Mia? No. Who's Mia? She's my sister. We were in a GRE place together. I have to find her. Well, if she's alive, she must be pouring herself with water somewhere in the city. What? Not that I'd blame her. What, what are you saying? Fuck you! Whoa, Gadjo. Sign of the times. The world we live in. Just saying. I have to find her. Well, first, let's fuck out of here. Not sure we managed to ditch that psycho. I love how she put a fucking pallet in front of the door. You know how light these pallets are? I can pick up like three of them bitches. 
They're very hey, light. Wait! That would do nothing. Hell, she's fast. Also, by me saying I can pick up three, that's not bragging. I'm fucking weak as shit. Three is the still super the light. Not far away. But we'll be safe there. I just have no muscles. Fuck me, the light came on and scared the shit out of me. I had the little click sound, I was just like, oh, I'm dead. The military, they're here! Bring them in. No. Ada. Uh, Earth to Aiden. Man, you were just a million miles away. Do you have nightmares about what he did to us? All the time. That's why I want to kill the fucker. Waltz is number three on my list. What about the rest of the kids who were in the hospital? Oh, man. Someday someone will write a book about it. And it ain't gonna be a bedtime story. Most of them are gone. I ran across one guy, though. He'll sleep with a knife in his hand for the rest of his life. In the refrigerator, he converted into a shelter for himself. That he'll never leave. We didn't organize a therapy group, if that's what you're asking. So, Waltz experimented on you? When? How long? When? It's blurry, the time I spent there. But I was a lucky one. Managed to run after a few weeks. I don't remember you. I'll take that as a compliment. Those who do don't usually have fond memories. Most prefer to forget me. If they survive. Yeah, but you ran. Sort of. Wait, you got a hit list? <laughs> Seriously? Do I look like I'm kidding? The city's got a lot of trash, and I'm the maid who's gonna make it the capital of cleanliness. Uh, who else is on it? Besides Waltz, Butcher, Hakon, and... You know what? It's a very long list. There's a few small fries that deserve a bolt between the eyes as well. And by whose authority are you doing this? <laughs> you kidding me? The highest court of justice in the land. My own noble authority, your honor. And you? What were you doing with that bastard hack on? You'll have a hard time believing this, but he saved my life. When I came to town, I was infected, and no biomarker. People of the bazaar wanted to hang me. Sure, I'd do it myself. But he got me out of there, got me a biomarker. Can't believe he duped me. He dupes everyone, like everyone. I trusted him once too. Really? Tell me about it. Maybe someday, but my story's similar to yours. He tricked me, and people died. Better forget about him. Or do like me. When you see him next, make sure you have a crossbow and a bunch of bolts handy. Okay, enough chatting. Let's go. Hmm, <laughs> bossy. I like that. We gotta go. I think next episode of the episode after two, we're gonna go to the little developer room. Cause there's some actually like super good shit to get there and it's in the city center area. You get this one charm that will repair your weapon and I think you can use it endlessly. Aiden, you there? Yeah. And there's some other cool shit there. I think there was wow. uh I thought you were gone. Some funny weapons. Apparently Waltz was doing these experiments on the sly. <laughs> Fucking psycho. But and no one in the GRE noticed? At some point, they did. I heard that's why they kicked him out. Too bad it was too late. Well, the GRE was bad to begin with, so... I mean, you remember the, first on the list? Because he killed Lucas? No. I like those blue puppets, the PKs. But no, I don't give a shit about Lucas's death. And why then? That, my dear, is a long story for another day. Let's just say everyone on that list deserves a headshot, and Hakon deserves something worse. Fuck! This was always open. We're locked out. <sighs> Fucking great! We're not locked out. It's just a GRE key. That we have to This is a GRE snack. facility, isn't it? Oh man! It worked! Where did you get that? You know Dylan? 
How do you know Dylan? <laughs> no is an overstatement. He contacted me because he wanted to escape the city and waltz. He was frightened. Something must have happened, or he found something. What could he have found? I don't know. He knew I was in touch with Frank, but then Dylan just disappeared, stopped making contact. Yeah, he died a while back. Dylan gave me this before he died. Waltz killed him. Fucking... So he got him after all. Also, Dylan told me to find someone named Lawan. You know who that is? <sighs> Maybe we were meant to meet each other. The universe brought us together for some fucked up reason. What? I am Lawan. Dylan wanted to contact Frank. He said the PK commander at Lucas found something. Something Waltz had been looking for for a long oh, time. Oh shit, that's like a huge conspiracy. <laughs> He wanted to escape the city. It's connected so to so many different it. people. The GRE key? I have it now. <laughs> Probably. Lucas died because of this gizmo. Dylan, too. Watch out. Or you'll be next. It's valuable. For Waltz, invaluable, I suppose. So you'd better not lose it. Look out! Now what's going on? Impossible. Waltz must have switched on the generators. Waltz, but why? Don't have a clue. Who knows what's in that fucker's head? Come on. <sighs> Hurry, Ladies before they go off again. The train is delayed. The Metro service is sorry for any inconvenience. Please mind the gap. Thank you for your attention. You're fucking welcome. Hurry, Aiden. Seems we have a clear path to the central loop. I like her. As a character too. I like Oh, we got a bow, let's go. I genuinely thought I wouldn't I would not like her as a character like whatsoever. Because in my mind I was like, oh they're just like doing um just a cheap grab at like a fucking at um fuck, what am I trying to say? <laughs> Oh, I thought I was going to hate her character because I thought they were just doing like a grab. Hey, we have a huge celebrity in our game. We're going to, you know what I mean? I thought that's what they were doing. I thought they were just like, we have a celebrity uh, by the game, basically type of thing. But she's actually a decent character. She, she's a good character so far. The only problem I have with her at the moment is a few of her lines are delivered poorly. <laughs> Only a few of them, though. I want. I, I'm curious if they have like a, a thing up, Aiden. going over her experience with the game, uh, with uh, making Dying Light 2. Uh, I would like to watch that if they do have something like that. Nice. So I think I, I said we were gonna upgrade health one more time and then focus all on parkour again on stamina let me just got new pants let me just see i'm gonna do this one because it gives us more xp and that's really where my mind is at right now is i just i just want xp at the moment i was sightseeing <laughs> funny that wasn't Fuck. a joke i was sightseeing oh, shit. look lights here too look it's it's fucking unbelievable! Oh, come up to the roof. We'll check it from above. The See you at the top. To lead us to heaven. Oh, is that what he did with the GRE key? Was turn on the power and shit? Fast travel options have been unlocked. So we're in the central loop now. Yep. So we got. We can actually fast travel now. Cool. Awesome. Come on, Eden, quick! We have to see this from the roof. Hey, where cool. are you? I think I think that's what he did with the GRE key. I think he turned on the power. I was wrong. Can't see shit. Every 
really thought it'd work. We were fucking duped. Ah, uh, well, um... At least it's peaceful. Yep. That's why I come here when I'm pissed off. So a lot, believe me. Look! Aiden! They're back on! Uh, they're fucking coming back on! <laughs> you see that, Aiden? You see that? It's beautiful! Oh, I can't believe it! No, I just can't believe it! <laughs> we just met. Laban, you seeing this? Oh, I see it, Daniel. I'm at a lookout point, and it's quite the show. How'd this happen? Dark as hell for 15 years, and suddenly this? I don't know. Don't know. But we need to find out. Then drop by the canteen and let's talk. Been missing you like last year's snow, Loka. While shotgunning beers and screwing bartenders. You know me. It's a gift. We'll meet you there, dumbass. Something's wrong. No. Oh, no, 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 no! No! Fuck! What the hell's going on? So that's the fish eye. Okay, how do we get there? The fish eyes gotta wait. You gotta wait, but why? We need to check the substations. One's over there, level with the PK tower. What about the fish eye? Listen, I wanna help you, and I will help. We'll do this together. But you have to understand, it's the first. It's been the same situation for over 10 years. 10 years of this fucking darkness. We gotta check this out. How do we get to the substation? It's an old paraglider. It'll help you get to places you normally can't reach. Just follow me. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, Fuck. Okay. Hold square to open paraglider. Paraglider just Okay. So actually, so. Uh, the little thing, the building we need to get to is over here, by the way, for the little developer room. But we can actually upgrade this three times. Yeah. Come on, not bad for a rookie. <laughs> it's easier than it looks. I still can't believe this is happening. I think Walt's turned the power on somehow. But why would he do that? He's never helped anyone. Why would he give people power back? Are you sure it was him? I he used the GRE key in the car factory. I think that's when everything lit up. That makes sense. Years ago, the military took over the plant to secure the energy cells on the hills. But I had no idea they could still be made to work and power half the city. Keep an eye on that key, Aiden. Hell knows what else can be done with it. We better hurry to the substation. You lead the way. Using air vents, flying in air vents, paraglider, commercial boost. Follow the takeoff directly from an air vent with paraglider stand on the vent and hold square. Okay. Fuck. You better keep practicing if you hope to beat me. I didn't know it was right. God damn it. It's always a race, Aiden. Oh, I forgot we had a bow. I instantly ran out of stamina because I accidentally used dash. to control the wind. Otherwise, it controls you. Okay, 
Okay, from here, it's not far at all to the substation. Go there and activate it. On my own? <laughs> You're a big boy. You'll figure it out. There's another one near the metro. I'll check that one. If we get one or both of these working, it means we can activate all of them. Hey, but how do I activate it? It's not rocket science, Aiden. Those are old systems. I guess we need to make sure fuses and cables are working. It's in this direction. This paraglider, can it be made to fly faster? Possibly, but that's something you should ask the craftmaster about. This is, I mean, this is cool. I like the paraglider. So, I guess technically we're now like in the second half of the game. But I mean, in my eyes, this is really just the beginning of the game, you know? Like, cause in my opinion, that whole part we were at right now was, uh, that whole beginning city was still just a prologue, you know? Those paragliders? It used to be a Night Runner's favorite toy. You were Night Runner? Me? Night Runner? <laughs> I wish. They were really something, Aiden. Real heroes. The only thing I had in common with them was substance abuse. But, maybe. Someday. Inhibitor container detected. I'm just gonna follow this little path. Seen any signs of renegades around here? No. See, Private? Now calm down and let Aglot think. What's there to think about? Why not head back to base? Who the heck are you, anyway? I'm someone offering to help. I'll check what happened to the power. You know anything else about it? That's top secret military information. We're trying to figure out how to get up there. Just go ahead and tell him everything, why don't you? Every last detail. Well, what's the big secret, huh? We need to get this piece of shit <coughs> working. That's what. My colleague's vastly oversimplifying things, but his gist is correct. There are obvious signs of the electricity having returned, and this here appears to be a substation. It and others like it are capable of transmitting electricity throughout the city. We have orders to get this building functioning once more. Meaning, turn it back on. Unfortunately, without climbing equipment, access to it is severely limited. You want the electricity for the peacekeepers? What would you do with it? Plug shit in. What do you think? The gentleman here must be asking how it would affect other people if the control of power is in the hands of peacekeepers. The answer, however, is relatively simple as well. Whoever controls the power controls the city. I got it. In any case, I don't need equipment to get up there. I can climb up there without the equipment. You'd be willing to do that? You'd be doing a great favor for the peacekeeper. Uniform! The quads! Electricity brings all the lights up! Just raring to get flames What was that ass. he said? I think it was something about his mother and a goat. PK morons! We'll be taking that electricity! 
like you very much. Kill him. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, the bow sucks. I got it. Hey. I like this guy actually, even though he's just a, not him. I like this guy. What about you, bud? Who taught you how to fight like that? Name's Aiden. Hey, you guys know this one? What do the bullets say to the man that got shot? Just passing through. Yeah! <laughs> you sever his limbs with a machete, Nitaf. Technically speaking, that's a melee weapon. While bullets are reserved for... I'm glad you're fine, too. You still want to climb up there, Aiden? Not for free, of course. We reward specialists fittingly. Well, no time like now. If you need any help up there, give us a holler over the radio. Aglot's good with electronics. However, from here, I can estimate the level of damage done to the apparatus. Aglot's got a knack for electronics. I was already up there once, but I couldn't fucking get in because it was boarded up. So now I gotta climb all the way back up. Um... I think I'm gonna do it this way. Oh, what the fuck. <laughs> Jesus. That was me just not knowing how to do anything. There we go. Inside. How's it look? Somebody was in a big hurry when they took it offline. I would surmise the main circuit suffered a break. Find a cable and connect the source of power to the transmitter. That should restore the circuit. Uh, to the facility for the city, after activating it, you will be used. To activate the electric electrical station, you need to repair broken connections. I got it. Understand what I need to do. Uh, I want to get to the inhibitor. It's above me. Locked from the inside. So I gotta go around. Neither one of those are green, but the dot came up is green. It's funny. Alright, let's see if I can pick this lock. That's what's up. Damn, I, so I don't know how to get that inhibitor. I gotta go down a floor to get it. Container nearby. 
but unless I did not think that would hurt. Here we go. This is something. Right? Um, and then. Let's see, let's see. Oh, it's it's all on the ground level, all the stuff I have to do. I'm just trying to figure out if there's a way up there, I think, to get that inhibitor. I think I'm gonna have to turn on the power first, maybe. Because I just, I don't see a way to get up there. All right, so three, two, is that, how do I? Report in. Yep, I'm on top of the substation, trying to connect power to the transmitter. Uh, it wasn't a piece of cake in here after all. Sure you're gonna make it? I met a bunch of PKs who couldn't get to the substation themselves. So that's why you haven't called me yet. You should see them. Get to decide which one I like more. You know that'll cost you, right? The peacekeepers, they're all right. But they're not the sort to help out of the kindness of their hearts. I wouldn't know what to do if it wasn't for them. Besides, they're down there and I'm the one up here. Tough choice, huh? I wouldn't give it to them. I mean, fuck them. They have their own men. And what about the free folk? Someone should be on their side. Who else if not people like us? Hmm. I'll think about it. Just don't take too long, Gaja. Wait, what? I'm already done here, and you're dicking around over there. Always with the competition, huh? I know the fucking inhibitor container is nearby and it's pissing me off. See, I see how to open this one, but I have no idea how to open the one upstairs. Like, at all. Just a chest in here. <laughs> All right, what do we get? I saw a blade axe. That's pretty cool, I guess. Oh. What the fuck? Why? I, I, why is it doing this? I don't know why it was doing that, dude. <laughs> okay. Let's head upstairs, because the thing was upstairs. One of them, at least. Let's head upstairs and figure this out. Um, all right. I can't get the other one? Okay. Another lockpick. Um, alright, 
So we're gonna go up one more floor because, okay. And the, that one's right here. Before I do that, because I'm pretty sure when you end locations like this, all the loot despawns or whatever. So I need to figure out how to get to that inhibitor container. I need to probably enter it from somewhere up here, right? Like there has to be, there has to be some way to get to it. Right there. Or did I, oh. Did I already go all the way up the stairs? I think I did, huh? Yeah, I did, because I opened this door. I still, though, I wonder if there is something I missed, like a vent or something. We just need a way to get directly under us. There's no like vent or a way to drop down or something. Or wait, I'm stupid. I just realized this right here. Where does this drop down? back down um this is gonna make piss me off dude how do I get into where that inhibitor is uh, I want to figure this out real quick I can't figure it out in like the next like two seconds though, I'll just stop trying, I guess. But like, I, I just, I don't see how you would do it at all. see another way in there though except to like go all the way around which I can't do Elevators closed in the upper levels. I don't know. I guess I'll just activate the power, hopefully. Unless maybe there's. Yeah, there's no like door right here at all. I don't know. I'll just activate the power, I guess. I would have liked to get that inhibitor, but I just. I genuinely don't know how to. It in. What now? Activate the control unit. It's in the control room. On my way. Your help is an important contribution to make this city safer. I just wanted to say that so you feel appreciated and, and so you understand how important this is. Okay. Thank you. I guess. Dude, that makes me so mad that I can't figure out how to get up there. It's that third floor right there. I need a way up. Oh. Yep, so I just wasted so much time. I just had to activate the power. <laughs> yep, I just had to activate the power. Okay. Cool. That doesn't irritate me in the slightest.
Nice. We can already upgrade another one. We're gonna do stand. Uh, we're gonna do parkour. And then we got new shoes. Trash. Trash. <laughs> Uh, and then now we can actually do this because it is broken as shit. And we're good for that. Alright. Let's activate the power. It's bro. Oh, okay. As I said, I think from here on out, the next four are all gonna go to the peacekeepers so I can get the elemental bolts and stuff. The blueprints for it. Because these, these just help you get around. There's no weapons or anything involved. Plus, there's actually, like, these are some pretty good little upgrades you get for doing, for uh, giving it to the peacekeepers, so. I'm just gonna skip it. They're, like, always the same. Not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad. Right, Aglot? Optimal, even. Here's your pay, as per our verbal agreement. Working with you has been a pleasure, Aiden. Same. You take care of yourselves. I like that guy. He's cool. He's just a side character, but he, he's really nice. 750. Not too bad. So we got a parkour skill. Fast climb, sleek runner, far jump, dash. So it upgrades dash. Enemy jump. Oh, see, that's what I like doing from the first game. Increase your speed while navigating tricky. Um... Hard jump. Tap L1 when I'm jumping over obstacles. That's kind of insane. And then you get double jump from that. Let me see this. Holy hell. And then rotate jump. Oh, that's pretty cool, I guess. Uh, I think fast climbs might be worth getting. I don't know. It's kind of hard. I think I'm going to do far jump just because it looks kind of crazy. So you did it. Are you pissed at me? Nah, your choice. And I know why. But if it were me, I'm for the free folk all the way. There are a lot more substations. If we could get them all going... Can we first go to the fisheye and... Yeah, sure. Let's meet in the canteen. I'll wait for you there. Cool. Yeah. Um... This is like a big fucking little settlement. Electricity is a strategic resource. It should be out. Okay. I want to keep that just because it's goofy, but we can get rid of, like, these level one stuff. Get rid of all our valuables, which is a bunch, and then we can get rid of all our extra gear that I don't need because I mean there's quite a bit of it um and then I think that's where we're gonna end this episode guys so I hope you enjoyed if you did please don't forget to like and subscribe uh, um comment down below what you guys want to see on the channel in the future I'll see you guys very soon in the next one stay safe out there and peace out guys